everybody. Welcome to Taste Test Tuesday. I'm formally greeting you guys to my channel. <laughs> I went shopping. Vagina. I'm not. I went to Regina, which is in my province. It's in Saskatchewan. It's our capital. Oh. And I went to Dessert Sweets. I always thought it said dessert. And then I'm like, it's an A. It says dessert. I mean, when I paint a picture, it's dessert. <laughs> and I got a lot of different cool items. I don't really want to cut titles taste test, but I got some things that are like all over the place. So, and I got something from a different country. So, <gasps> we're excited. I love trying foods and snacks. So, um, this is Tuesday. Try something new, new today. And if you guys want to subscribe, it is free to do so. And I wish that you would. <laughs> And if you guys like Taste Test Tuesdays, then you, you can go hit the thumbs up button. It really helps me out. Just a, just a little click, just a little click to show me that show me that you're watching and show me that you're there and you're a real person. I'm a real boy. <laughs> and I had this stuff and when I buy things for Taste Test, I like forget that they're in my, my pantry and then they all go expire. And then I'm like, oh, this tastes sour. I'm like, girl, it's not the thing's fault. Oh, I'm so excited. Ready? Let's, let's just get into it and devour everything. I got a lot of stuff. Like there's like, this doesn't look like a lot, but it's a lot. The first thing I'm gonna try is bleh. Why don't I pick this out first? I got two cotton candies. Oh my God, I'm disgusted already. So I got bacon cotton candy and pickle cotton candy. Yum, I love, I love me a pickle. <laughs> this is what we're working with. And they're like, whoa, you're getting sleep. Whoa. Oh God. Oh no, I'm gay. Uh oh. Me after one shot. I'm scared of this one now. Mmm, it smells like dill. It's a big dill because it smells like dill. <laughs> Why did I do this? It seems like a good, good thing at the time. And then, ooh, ugh. You know, it looks like cotton candy. It smells like cotton. No, it doesn't. It smells like friggin' like a pig factory. <laughs> Yo. The sweet and salty though. Okay. It's not good, but it's not bad. But I'm not gonna eat anymore. <laughs> it tastes like bacon, but without crunchy. It's like soft bacon. Like, it's like candy bacon, but like really soft. Oh my God, anyway. It's like a fake bacon flavor. You know, like the bacon bits. It doesn't taste like bacon. It tastes like those like fake little, those like plastic bacon bits. We have high, high hopes for a living with this. Honestly, the color of it is exquisite. I'm like, yup. Oh my God, it smells so good. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. The bacon one <laughs> is way better. This is so disgusting. I can't even. Like what? It doesn't work at all. Ugh. Maybe I need a bigger one. <laughs> Absolutely not. Oh my God. It tastes like fresh, fresh dill with sugar on top. I mean, that might sound good to some people, but that is like horrific. Just disgusting. Okay, let's try something different. The thing I got from Holland. It's like a cigar. <laughs> Okay, this was from Holland. Um, it said on it, what did it say? Oh my God, you guys are looking at it here. It says uh, what it's the, what it tastes like or whatever. I don't remember because it was so long ago. But yeah, it was imported from Holland and this is what the packaging looks like. It's really like authentic and it looks like a cigar. I'm very intrigued by this. This is amazing. I love trying things from different places. Oh, it smells like a cinnamon stick. Oh my God. It smells really strong like cinnamon. I feel like I'm, I'm back in like 2010 and I'm doing the cinnamon challenge. Ow! Ow, my tooth! <laughs> Ow, my jaw! This is so cool. Oh my God, it tastes so good. I just, I don't think I know how to eat it. Maybe you're not supposed to bite it. Mmm. Let me take smaller bites. Mmm. It has a really strong scent of cinnamon, but it doesn't have a strong flavor of it when you bite it. It's just like the perfect amount. Um, I know it sounds really hard, especially when I craft it, but it's not like, like a lifesaver or like um something like a really hard candy. It melts in your mouth immediately. It like crumbles and melts right away. This is really good actually. Yum, okay. Okay, next I'm gonna try a drink and this is Mountain Dew Voodoo um, Soda. It says mystery flavor, limited edition 2021. So I have no idea what this is. There's like literally death right there waiting to take me. So I'm kind of scared to drink this. I don't know what mystery flavor is gonna be, obviously, because it's a mystery. I'm not like a big Mountain Dew drinker either. Like I like it, but I'm not like 
obsessed with Mountain Dew. It smells like blue. <laughs> I don't want anyone to even tell me that that's wrong or I'm being dumb. Because blue, <laughs> the blue candy, it's never blueberry. It's never like, to me, anything else. It just tastes like blue. <laughs> the blue gummies and stuff like that, they never taste like anything. Like they taste like something, but like they taste blue. That's what this smells like. And somebody out there can relate. I know you can. What, what is that? It tastes like ants. <laughs> I don't like it. It tastes like kind of like cotton candy, like traditional cotton candy with like cream soda-ish vibe, but maybe like a dot of blue raspberry. Not like sourness, but like a dot of it, like mixed with all those flavors. I don't really like it. And you know what? Now I'm really thinking about it, it tastes like grape. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I have no idea what the frick this is. This is a this is a, still a mystery. It's still a mystery to me. What else I got in my box of tricks? Let's just pull out. What did I get? <gasps> what is that? I forgot that I got this. This is a candy grinder. Oh my God. So it doesn't say if it's sour or anything like that. It just says candy grinder on it. So I, I assume you do it just like um, pepper or salt. Like, I hope it makes that sound. This is so cool. It even has like the little top, like how pepper would be. Twist. Oh, you just twist over it. Okay. Oh my goodness. All right, girl. We're in this. Oh, how am I supposed to get the candy? Oh! It smells like Dollarama. Like it smells like when you enter Dollarama. <laughs> this is what we are looking at. So I just tip it over and, oh, there's already pebbles falling out. Me. Fun. It just tastes like, they're not Pop Rocks. If Pop Rocks didn't pop, that's what it tastes like. Not a lot come out. They're a mixture of like sweet and sour candies. Oh, I got a really sour one in there, but they're like sour and sweet. Mmm, this is cool. You can see that it's, there's the color of it. It's like blue. I don't even know which one I got. Maybe blue raspberry? Kinda does taste like blue raspberry now that I'm really thinking of it. But they're like a mixture of like sour and sweet. I just keep saying that. Like, we know, we heard you the first time. The novelty of it is like a little kid would love this. I wouldn't just like sit there and grind candy in my mouth. <laughs> but this would be so fun for like a stocking or like uh, treat bags and stuff like that or like Halloween candy. This would be so cool. Different way to eat your candy. Okay, next up, okay. There, I've always seen like gummy pizzas and stuff like that and they're literally just gummy. I've tried them before on Taste Test Tuesday. But this one was a little different. It says crispy base cheesecake. It has a crispy base. Three flavors taste like cheesecake, it says on it. So we're gonna give this a go. There's a crispy, I'm so intrigued by this right now. So this is what it looks like when you take it out of the packaging. This has me shook. Oh my God, that smells like cheesecake. Oh my God. Okay, that smells delicious. This is not what I was expecting. We are so excited. The world is evolving. We're trying the pink one, obviously. Look at the little slices. Oh my God, they all come out individually. Okay. Let's see, let's look, 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 Okay, so this is what we see when we're looking at it. So it's really like gummy on top and it is kind of like harder on the bottom. It's not crispy base, but it's a firm base. Why is this actually taste like cheesecake? It's like a lemon meringue pie or a lemon meringue cheesecake. Oh my God, yum, yum, yum. <laughs> yum, look at that, honestly. Is very surprising, it's fun to eat, and it does have a harder base. That is so surprising, I like that a lot. It's like that gummy that's like soft, and oh my God, it tastes like cheesecake. It literally tastes in my mouth, it's like cheesecake. It's like Willy Wonka when um, he's like, eat this, and it's like a full turkey dinner. That was literally like a gummy candy, and it like gave me the experience of a full cheesecake that I was eating. Ah. Next up in my box of tricks, I got a pop, or a soda. So this one is cucumber soda. It's made in the USA, it's made with pure cane sugar, and it says, y'all get your fixes. <laughs> and it has like little cucumbers on it. I don't know if this is gonna be like refreshing. I just thought it was different and odd and weird. So I wanted to get it. Mm. Oh, I did it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Hire me for your sound effects. Oh, that does not smell like cucumber. It smells like a shoe. Someone named Gregory wore that shoe. She tastes like cucumber, but mixed with Gregory's shoe. Oh my God, that's horrific. That's probably the worst thing we have yet. That's literally the worst thing we've had yet, 100%. It's the candy, <clears throat> sorry. Cotton candy has nothing on this. <laughs> don't get your fixins. Don't go anywhere near this. Oh my God, that made me physically ill. Let's try something that's gonna be good that I know is gonna be good next, which is Arizona. And I know we all have Arizona. Not everyone has Arizona, I shouldn't say that. But a lot of us know what Arizona is. These are new. Half and half fruit snacks. They're Arnold Palmer's. Um, mixed flavors, gluten-free, fat-free, made with real fruit, no preservatives. Um, hi! And then there is original strawberry, mango, and peach. Oh, they open so easily, look at that. Oh, 
<gasps> they knew it was coming. Oh, okay, they smell like an Arizona. Wow. This is what they look like. Yum. Oh my God, they're Arizona cans. I'm shocked. They're like little Arizona cans. Do you see this? <gasps> my camera being in focus for the first time in its life. There's a little one, it says Arizona across it. And then here's the little logo. My nails, I can't. The little logo as well. Ah! They're the perfect amount of gummy. Okay. These are the best things we tried yet. They are so gummy, but not like chewy. Like not like stringy or like super hard. They taste like Arizona. These are my snacks for tonight. Literally, this is like probably the one thing that I'm gonna actually like eat outside of the taste test. You know what I mean? Cause that's really important for a taste test to know like are you actually gonna eat it? Not just like, is it good? Cause the cheesecake things were good, but I probably wouldn't like sit down and watch a movie with these. I would with these. Yum. Now I wanna go with this. This was so intriguing. Juicy drop gummies, gummy candies and sour gel. And you can see there it has like a pen there and you squeeze it on. Oh my, like, what? Oh, okay. So there's just candies in here. Yeah, they smell yummy. It's, whoa! Where do you open it? I'm so confused. <gasps> you just push it. Oh, yeah. Oh my God, look at that. I'm not really one for sour candy, but this was just too intriguing and I want to like paint on it. So, ooh, put the little sour gel on. What? Strawberry kiwi sour gel. It's not like sour, so good. The candies, these are that like hard candy, hard chew. And nothing's really like sour, sour, but I like it. I like the flavor. I like this. I probably just eat this. Okay, that's sour. <laughs> Delicious. Next we have giant Skittles. They're not gonna taste any different, I know, but I'm just gonna make this one quick. But I just thought it was really cool and I can't open this shit without. <laughs> Let's see how giant they are. They're not really giant. I was expecting them to be giant. They're like big Skittles. They should have just said big. Okay, let's try a red one. Red. They're pretty big. But not giant. Oh, mm, I would prefer these over Skittles. Mm, I like these better regular Skittles. There's so much more room for activities. You get more crunch and more like softness. Mm, more flavor too. I love that. Okay, so next up, we're gonna try this green apple sour slime. Mm, mm, eh. Oh, <gasps> there's a spoon in there. Well, of course, how are you gonna eat it? Ah, it looks like a little alien. Oh, <laughs> Oh my god, it's literally like a jar of slime. <gasps> oh my god, it smells so bad. This is what the slime looks like. It's really slimy. It's actually really cool looking. Oh my god, that's so cool. I just want to play with this. <gasps> this is fun. A jar of slime. Yes, I would just give my child like a jar of sugar. <laughs> Liquid sugar. Suck that back. <laughs> I'm gonna just put my tongue through it like a like a fountain. Oh, it's really sour. Mm. It doesn't really taste good, to be honest with you. Uh-uh. What is that? That doesn't taste good at all. Oh my god. Refund. But it's fun. Refund. Put the fun back in refund. <laughs> Reese's Crunchy Snack Cake. Hey, logs. It's giving very log. <laughs> Huh? That is not the picture at all. What? <laughs> it's not even crunchy. It doesn't even taste like Reese. What the <laughs> I don't know what to think of that. Ooh, the chocolate is so good on there. Like, there's like a brownie in there. It's very soft and moist and delicious. And that's what I think is giving the most flavor. Okay, last but not least, we're gonna end with these sour bright dip in crawlers. What level of sour are you? <laughs> Zero. <laughs> so they look like this. There's like a little thing of powdered blue powder. And then there's some gummy worms here. So let's give this a go. Oh, yummy, they got, did you see that smoke come out of there? Oh, yummy, they got. Look at that blue powder. Look at it. So I do, do I just dunk them in? Do, do, will they Will they stick or do I need to lick it? I'm not licking it. So I got the pink one. Oh, <gasps> it coated right away. It's sour. It's kind of addicting. Mmm, it's like super sour. Then it dissipates. Okay, these are addicting. Mm. Oh my god. I'm all love. Come here, Wemmy. Ah. All right, so Sophie's here and she's like, me too, I want some food. <laughs> Girls, not your kind of food. Oh my god, I think the worst thing that I tried today was the, uh, the cucumber soda. That was the worst thing. It literally tastes like feet. And the best thing I tried today, mm, the best thing are probably those Arizona candies. And the thing from Holland, I don't know what it's, sorry, I don't know what exactly what it's called and I don't wanna try to pronounce it because I butcher it. Um, but I think that one was like intriguingly good. Like it was something that was very different. I think it was just like a different vibe. That was my taste test Tuesday of random goodies. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this and put a smile on your face. Try something new today and I love you guys so much. Talk to you later. Bye.